Hi everybody, it's Ms. Goldman and today you are at home learning while I'm actually at school teaching because we have now gone virtual for the rest of this week and next week. So let's get going with our calendar and circle time. So today is December 15th, 2020. We've been in school 60 days. As of today, we've been in school for 60 days. That's big guys. Remember, yesterday was Monday. That's when we had parent-teacher conferences. So I got to talk to all your parents. Today is Tuesday and tomorrow will be Wednesday. So now we're going to sing the days of the song. Now I'm going to sing it a few times. The first time I can't clap as well because I'm holding my pointer. The next time I'll be able to hold to clap better because I won't have a pointer in my hand. And remember when you're at home, you can be doing this as well because you know the song. Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. 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 Of the week. I'm going to do it again. I'm going to put these in. Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week, days of the week. There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. 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 Awesome job. Now remember, I want you to sing it at home too. Maybe you can make a video of you doing it for me. Now we're going to do our months of the year song. So I'm going to first do it again with the dance. The second time, I'm just going to point to the month. Let's get started. January, February, March, and April, May, June, July, and August, September, October, November, December. Then we turn around. Awesome. Let's do it together now this way, but you do the dance still. January, February, March, and April, May, June, July, and August, September, October, November, December, and we turn around. Amazing. Now let's go over to see what the weather is today. I'm hoping the weather is still what I'm predicting it is going to be for tomorrow, which is actually today for you, because I'm doing this the day before. Sunny. And when it is sunny in the winter, we know we can wear pants, a long sleeve shirt, or a long sleeve sweater or sweatshirt. So now let's go over to our letter of the week. So our letter this week is D. D, D, dog, D, D, dinosaur. We also know we could do some Disney characters like D, D, Donald Duck, D, D, Daisy Duck, or even D, D, Duck. And there's another duck we might not have thought of, D, D, Dewey Duck, who is one of uh, Daisy and Donald's nephews. So, we have those, and then the dinosaur again, the the dog. Can you think of some other words that start with did, did. I know one of the students in our class, da da Devin. His name starts with a D. So now let's go over our rhyme of the week. And if you can think of some other words that rhyme, please let me know. So we have jet and net rhyme. So jet rhymes with net, and net rhymes with jet. Can you think of some other words like bet, set, met? You can think of some other words that even if they aren't real words, but they rhyme with it, that's okay. Just practice it. Our color of the week is purple. See if you can find some purple things at home. That's part of your homework for this week. And our shape of the week is a heart. So see if you can make a heart. You can draw it out this way and draw it out that way so I can see. Or make a heart with your hands. Make one side and make like a C and another C and connect them together. And then we have it here, I'll put it down here so you can see it on my shirt because it's dark. And now let's go over our number of the week. It is 13. So let's count 13 forward and then backwards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13. Great job. Now let's do it backwards. 13, 12, 11, 
10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Amazing job with that. And now it's time for our stretches. So I'm going to do some stretches with you that we normally do in class. I want you to try the other ones at home and think of some others. So, you know, the first thing we always do is 13 jumps. So let's do it. I'm going to move over so you can still see the number 13. So let's do 13 jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 10, 11, 12, 13. Now let's do 13 jumpy jacks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Great. Now remember, normally what we would do next is toe touches, but if I go down to touch the floor, you won't see me. And then after that, we normally do our push ups. Again, you won't see me. And then our sit ups. And then you get to choose what we do next. So we might do some scissors. We might do balancing on one foot. I know you can't see the foot. Some lunges. Maybe some squats, maybe some shoulder rolls, so you can think of things to do for 13 times. And until then, I will see you tomorrow. So my musketeers, goodbye, stay safe, be smart, go for the gold.